Emily Post was the only daughter of an architect, and was raised in a privileged world. Educated first at home, she would ultimately attend a finishing school in New York. Once introduced into society, she would become a popular debutante and caught the eye of Edwin Main Post, a banker, whom she would marry in 1892. The couple would go on to have two sons, and she eventually divorced him due to his lack of faithfulness. Post had an interest in writing and when she found she was in need of money she cashed in on her society contacts and got work writing for such magazines as Harper's, Scribner's, and The Century. Her articles ranged from architecture and interior design to short stories and serials. She would also write a few novels including Flight of the Moth, Purple and Fine Linen, Woven in the Tapestry, The Title Market, and The Eagle's Feather. She also turned her hand to writing travel books, these having a humorous bent. In 1922, she would publish the work that she was most famous for, her book Etiquette. It not only became a huge bestseller but would make Emily Post a household name. The book continues to be updated and reprinted until this day. Her popularity led to a radio show and a syndicated column. She claimed that she wrote her book to try to bring common sense and flexibility to good manners. Her success in doing this and her continued desire to want to education others led her to found the Emily Post Institute in 1946. Decades after her death her legacy lives on in the institute as generations of her family continue in the work that made her famous. <laughs>